Welcome back guys. Today we are going to see the procedures of weighing a baby and these are the step by step guide. The one I'm going to give you in case if you go to the practical room you know I'm supposed to do this, this, this. So let's dive in. Number one, you need to set the necessary equipment, but mostly this time they will get when everything is already set. For you, you'll just do the procedure, unless they say you set and do the procedure. But you have only five minutes, so they are going to set for you, and then you will do the thing. So in other cases, you will not get everything, then you have to ask for the thing which is missing. So what are those uh, things which is needed? Need weighing scale, patient charts, light paper to prevent baby from coldness. You know when you are weighing baby, grams also is counted in. So clothes have some grams, so they need to exclude that gram away. Ah, uh, so that is the first step. Then, if they give you only the weighing scale and the paper is not there, you need to ask for the paper. If the baby, if the patient's chart, the baby's chart is not there, you need to ask for the chart. That one is also marked. Only those things alone, you get three marks. See, just asking for the wind, the one which is not there. You need to have weighing scale, you need to have the patient chart, you need to have the paper. So if the baby is some like man, you need to ask them for weighing bags in case they are not there. And then the second step is you need to explain the procedure to the mother and have to provide privacy. You know, everything needs privacy. Remember, you handle patients individually and then you also need to consider the privacy see so how do you provide privacy you need to have a screen and then you need to wash the hand you wash your hand that one you get one mark the first step equipment you get three marks explaining the procedure to the mother the caregiver and then just providing privacy you get two marks and then washing hand is one mark that one is already six marks so don't miss these marks mm -hmm. and then adjust the weighing scales reading to zero reading to zero always they give you manual they, they don't give this one of digital they give manual so you need to adjust to zero. Sometimes they will also adjust it to one, two, just also to the other side of negative. So you need to be careful when you are doing this. You just need to adjust it to zero if it is not at zero. So if it is at zero, you just say that need, this one is already at zero. So they also give you mark. That one is just adjust, give four marks. Four marks because if you give a wrong weight they give either high dose or low dose so that's why the mark is high for mark place the light paper on the weighing scale and balance the scale you need to place that to remember to prevent coldness that one will get two marks and then make the baby on the light Paper. Make the baby on the light paper. This one also one mark. You'll get one mark. And then read and chart the finding to the patient's chart. Remember everything you do you need to record it. So you need to read and record it on the patient's chart. This one also you get one mark. Then you thank the mother for her cooperation or the father for the cooperation. That one also you get one mark. 
the thanking also gives some, make them feel they have done something good. And so next time they come, you can cooperate this one in a practical field, but this one here in a practical exam. So just thank, thank you for that operation. And then health educate the mother on the weight, whether the baby is growing or not. To say thank you, the baby is increasing in the weight or the baby is reducing in weight, whether it is as reduced or not because you don't have the record. You say thank you, the baby has improved, has increased in the weight. Thank you for taking good care of the baby. This one also you get three marks, just educating, just saying those words. And then you clear away. You clear everything you do, you need to clear away. You don't. So, in summary, step by step in weighing a child, taking a weight of the baby, one, you need to gather the materials, but mostly you will get when the material has already been gathered. Two, you need to explain the procedure to the mother and provide privacy. And then three, you need to wash your hand. And then four, you adjust the weighing scale to zero. Remember, to zero. Every reading starts from zero. And then place the light paper on the weighing scale and balance the scale. Then make the baby on the light paper. You will put on the light paper. Paper. And then you read the, and chart the findings on the person's chart, on the baby's chart, the one they have given you. And then thank the mother or the father for cooperation. Then you health educate them. Health education doesn't mean you don't need to go through the process. Just say thank you, the baby has improved. I've seen the weight increase. And then you need to clear away. So those are the steps to follow when they are brought for you taking a weight of the baby. Thank you for watching and see you in the next one.